Hi, thanks for stopping by. If you haven't been here before, my name is Lisa and I basically love handbags. So today's video is an unboxing, so I hope you stick around and watch. So the lip gloss of the day is Marc Jacobs and I believe it's number 392 and I like it because although it might be a little sticky, it's not that tacky. <laughs> It's not that tacky stuck to your teeth sticky. So I'm going to show you Mr. Noisemaker in one second. And that was the lip gloss of the day. The scent of the day is Caroline Herrera's Good Girl. Again, I love this scent. It is definitely in my top five. And in my last video, I had mentioned that I wish they made a travel size version. And one of my favorite people showed up in my office and got me this isn't that cute it's like a little baby oh my god that's so cute thank you i didn't ask you if i could say your name so i won't but you know that i adore you and thank you so much i love it it's adorable and it will go in my purse and speaking of the purse of the day is the gucci jackie bag i like this bag a lot I will say she's not a love, but I have just resolved to wear her as a crook of my arm type of bag because that leather piece that goes on to make this a, sh a long shorter bag has never gotten any softer. It is as stiff as it was when I bought it and that's just what it is, but I still like the bag so that's that. Now, let me get to the unboxing. Oh, actually, let me get to my noisemaker over here real quick, and I'll be right back with you. So, my little noisemaker, Renji Obarai, has found his voice. And it is so funny because he normally only barks whenever he sees himself in a mirror. He just barks at his own reflection, and I think it's hilarious. It can be a mongoose, a bird, another dog, or anything else walking by, and he will make a peep. He just walks up, wags his tail, and I guess prays for love. But as soon as he sees himself, he's gonna make a noise. So I hope you heard his bark, and that's probably the only time you'll hear it, because we hear it maybe once a day. Because sometimes he'll either sneak into my bedroom or our curio cabinet has a mirror in the back and he'll see his own reflection and then just bark it is so funny so i'm gonna take him back downstairs Oy. and that was my ringy cameo for the day i know you're so cute um i just don't want him to chew anything that does not belong to him up here and he's still learning so he's almost four months so he's still a baby and he's still trying to, you know, figure it out. But he's such a good boy and he's so much love and so fun and so cute. Even when he does something naughty, he's still cute. So it's hard to even be mad for more than a second with him. Okay, so give me one second to take him downstairs. So today's unboxing is a Burberry unboxing. I went to Burberry, I think it was over a week ago, it was a week ago, and I picked up just a few things from, they had like a little private event to introduce some products, and although I am not a huge fan of the um, new Burberry TV logo, I am definitely, definitely an old school Burberry check girl. Definitely. So I picked these up. I thought they were super cute. And I like that they are leather on the toe instead of um and the tan, not the white. I like the white ones, but they screamed I'm gonna get dirty. And oh my god, Renji just ran himself up here. Okay, give me a second. Renji, did you come up those stairs by yourself? Yeah, you did. Uh -huh. 
And while I was at the private event, um, our essay, Nikki, she's so sweet, she gifted us little chocolates that say Burberry. I hope you can, oh, let's see, is that better? Yeah, I think so. Little Burberry chocolates, how sweet. And I think that seems to be the trend with all the luxury houses. Everybody seems to have their own custom um, macaroons or chocolates or something, which I think is pretty dang cool. And then the next thing I picked up was it was actually for this bag right here. It came with a brown thin leather strap and I didn't care for it to be honest. So I picked up an additional strap for it. It says Burberry. I thought this was gorgeous. The original one I wanted had um, a leather trim and I actually liked it more, but that one was not adjustable and this one is. So I like that better. So there's a strap and the other one has been discontinued. I looked everywhere and it was not to be found. And now the last one. Oh, it wasn't even in the dust bag. A Burberry bag. She is a crossbody. The strap has the Burberry embroidered into it. The only thing this bag is missing is a back pocket, but I will get over it. And I love that the magnets are super strong. So not only does it fit into this little slot here, the magnets where the two rivets are, are incredibly strong. I don't like bags with magnets that are weak. You know, I'm just like, just give me a good magnet. And inside, plenty of stuffing. Thank you, Nikki. This front is actually a little pocket. I definitely think my cell phone will fit inside and you know, whatever else I might wanna then just slide in, a card holder or something like that. And then there's a back pocket right there. It's leather and in gold, it does say Burberry. And then it's just a little pit and I like that. I like that it's a great crossbody for grab and go and you know if you're going to be shopping you want it shoulder bag, you want it crossbody, whatever you want this actually does it for you. So I am super happy with it and I'm going to insert a little bit of the blog and I will just say now I'm a little rusty so please forgive my finger being in front of everything. Hi guys, I'm here with Nikki. She Hi. is the best SA in Ala Moana Burberry. If you happen to stop by, make sure you visit Nikki. She's amazing. And today we are previewing the Summer Monogram, TV Summer Monogram. Woo -woo. So take a look at the store. It's so beautiful. And then I'm going to flip you around because Nikki is so amazing. They gave us one hour before the store opened to preview, have drinks, and a little snack, and I will hook you up with a little preview. And these are Pog Mimosas. So I believe Pog is passion orange juice. And of course, how can you not love muffins, fresh fruit, and Burberry macaroons. How can you not love that? Beautiful outfits. And I will definitely show you guys what we scored. And I am here with the lovely Tarina Monty. Let's go find Tarina and take a peek.
Now, this bag is one that I've never seen. It is almost like a distressed denim, and it has a top handle. It's very beautiful. I'm actually, I'm actually impressed and considering it. I think it reminds me of, you see how it's got the classic Burberry check in it? And then there's that new TV logo. So I like something like that it has both a mixture of the new and the old on it. Let's see. There's no back pocket. And there we are. Oh, I love the women's jacket. It's kind of one of those things where I kind of wish I lived somewhere where I could utilize a jacket, but then not really. And I love this tote. It actually reminds me of the Chanel tote. I don't recall what it was called, but it was the most popular Chanel tote ever. But that one's really nice as well. And let me feel it. Oh, the leather is like butter. Oh, and speaking of Burberry, I had my nail girl hook me up with a flex. So just one nail, but just for the event. Oh, and then the Fendi bag is Tarina's, and I am rocking my Fendi tote. I'm sorry, my Burberry tote. This is one of the bags I was looking at earlier. It's beautiful. And I actually really like the way it sets on my body. Because, you know, plus size women, we get slim pickings on straps. Oh, those are cute. And so are the sneakers. Nice. I hope they're, I wonder if they're comfortable. Alrighty, so... Renji whined and cried while he was downstairs, so I figured I'd bring him back up to say goodbye. I hope you liked the video. I hope you liked my bag. Thank you so much for your time. Have a great week. Aloha. Hey, hey. Oh, he wants down.